Hey y'all, Dan from an Alaskan Crafter here, and looky, day four, more construction. I cannot see what I'm filming because the sun is in my eyes, so hopefully y'all can see. We're coming up on uh, some construction again. Today, we are heading up to the old gold mine called Chicken! Chicken, Alaska. The rig that's in front of us is a really cool rig. Jeff and I saw it earlier. And ooh, oh, we're actually moving. We don't have to wait. Awesome. I do apologize for the icky windshield, but there's really nothing that we can do about that. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful day. Yes, we will have to wait. Hey, babe, I want one. Huh? I want one. <laughs> yeah. He says I do too. Well, now all we're gonna get pretty much is tall, tall bushes. I will be back later. Bye. There we are. This is the Taylor Highway. Jeff will correct me, but I think it's also top of the world highway. And we're I'm not gonna go all the way up. We're going 67 miles in. But look at this view. Other than the dang slow motorhome. Okay. Hang on with me, y'all. Papa's driving. Papa's driving. Toot, toot. Uh, motorhome number two. We we watched him turn the corner. Jeff gave out this audible groan. Oh, but he pulled over. Oh no, he didn't. See, I can't really see very much. <laughs> Because the sun is hitting the screen. It looked like he pulled over, but I guess not. Anyhow, this is some of the most gorgeous view. And uh, somebody had asked what had happened to our windshield. Well, this is very much so a very typical Alaskan windshield with cracks and little... Uh, rock chips because uh, we sand and gravel and all that in the winter time and it doesn't always get swept up in the street cleaner thingy sorry for the bumps but uh, yeah that's what happens it hits uh, no you can kind of see one behind the review mirror um, and I know, well, your insurance will take care of it, blah, blah, blah. But it's kind of one of those things of it's not impeding our, our vision. Um, and if we get a new one, it's just going to happen again. <laughs> so you just kind of sort of have to pick your battles. If you... Uh, there's a lot of, a lot of cars, a lot of trucks that have crack windshields in Alaska. And I think in a lot of northern country they do also. Look at that view. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, dark mode this morning. Okay, there we go. Okay, we'll see you again sometimes. I know it's kind of hard to see from this. <clears throat> but in between those two uh, spruce trees, there is just above those spruce trees, right in the middle, is kind of a uh, shiny, well, it's not shiny to y'all, but anyway, that's chicken. Next stop, this is where we had lunch. Jeff Lope spoils me. He waited. He waited until he could find 
the bestest spot with a view to have lunch. In Heath Batchel, I think so. Okay, we are in downtown Chicken. You can go ahead, babe. Thank you very much. You have downtown Chicken, Chicken Creek Cafe, Chicken Gas Station, International Airport of Chicken, and then, oh my gosh. Again, I can't see because of the glare, so here we are. Here's chicken. Don't blink. If you blink, we're gonna we're gonna pass it. <laughs> this is the township. Right there. That's it. That's chicken right there. <laughs> and there's the great big rooster. Oh look, chicken is open, honey. Yep. Okay, we'll see you in a little bit. Okay, this is the gold panner. Is he local? Decorated really cool. And the barking you hear is Kiva. Okay, y'all, this is a dredge, what they went down. Underneath has big, big scoops. I don't, I don't I see right any. Right-hand side. Right-hand side. I don't see any, but that's yeah. where the scoop would be. Oh, I'm sorry, that's where the scoop would be on the right-hand side where that tunnel-looking thing is, and it would also come from underneath. What did the big crane thing do? Is that like their... That's where they, the, which where they dump everything behind them. Oh, okay. Down that ramp. So that's how they move slower than a centipede, slower than a snail. Um, this one, as you can see, it says Pedro Dredge National Historic Site, open from... Operated. Op oh, I can't see. 1938 to 67. Operated from 1938 to 1967. The hose thing that you see on the left and right of the big spin wheel, those would, uh, it's high velocity and they would go into the banks and whatever flow would flow down, you'd go uh, mine it. Anything else, Daddy? Nope. Um, uh, it does totally process all the gold. gold. So whatever yeah. comes in the front gets run through all the processors, and then the debris is kicked out the back. Out the back. Yeah. And how many people usually are on there? You got a captain? I'm not a sure dozen? The, probably, because you've got. Yeah. The, About a dozen. I haven't done my homework on something like this in a long time. But they're monstrous, I mean, they're big. This is an example of the buckets that would go into that shaft and underneath. This one is much smaller, much, much smaller than what they would use. Okay, I goofed. That was the new chicken. This is the original chicken. And I believe this part and three buildings are for sale. So let's go check it out. Okay, here's one of the buildings. This looks like it's the cafe and also the camp and bees. Okay, that line in the middle of that mountain up there, it goes up and over the mountain. That's where we're headed. We're going back to toke. I tell y'all I'm exhausted because the excitement just made me blah, 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 and I'm so glad he took me.
Everybody give a round of applause for Mr. Jeffalope. Woo!